And the AP just right now called the race for Senator John Cornyn, reelected for a fourth term. Let's listen to Senator Cornyn and the remarks he made just moments ago. Good evening, and what a night. You know, critics would say it's about personalities. The personalities come and go. Only our character as a great state and nation endures. I'm so happy to share this moment with my wife, Sandy, who's been on my side since I first ran for district judge in San Antonio a long time ago. And our two daughters, two strong Texas women who've always been a point of inspiration and pride for me. I wanna thank every Texan across our great state who cast their ballot. This is a historic election for so many reasons. Whether I earned your vote or whether you were pulling for my opponent, I'm honored and committed to serving and representing all Texans. My goal as your United States Senator is simple. Continue to make Texas a place of exceptional opportunity for all. In the next six years, I look forward to our visits, our celebrations, and working together to overcome whatever challenges may come our way. Generations of Texans and Americans have fought for the freedom to make our own choices. I'm honored to serve in Sam Houston's Senate seat. He believed that what was good for Texas was good for America, and I think he was right. Texans are entrepreneurs, cowboys, wildcatters, and astronauts. We're working parents, students, teachers, and immigrants. Whatever hat we wear, we often find that despite our differences, we are united by our core values faith, family, and freedom. These are the tenets that have made Texas and our nation so successful. And they are what guide me as I work hard to serve 29 million Texans. I'm glad we had this fight. It's a fight for the soul of our nation and our state. Let me close by saying this, serving as your United States Senator has been the privilege of my lifetime. We have accomplished a lot together, but we have more to do. And while we may be separated, we must also now be united. So together, we'll get down the road and we'll work hard to make sure our state continues to be the best place in the world to live, work, and raise a family. Thank you, God bless you, and may God continue to bless the great state of Texas. All right, we just watched Senator John Cornyn declare victory, and he said that he wants to uh, unite the state. He said they have accomplished a lot, and he says he has more to do. He will have another six years in office right now. And I wanna put the uh, results back up on the screen to show you that his margin of victory, eight percentage points, the Associated Press has now called this race for Senator Cornyn. Uh, this is even more a wider margin of victory so far night's still young, then even the polls, the real clear uh, politics average of polls had given uh, him a margin of about 6.8 percentage points.